and finally tonight, Jenna Harner and I got everyone something for Christmas. It isn't much, but it is our WEMY Top Plays of the Week. Let's get it going. In the fifth spot this week, Thomas Edison Boys Basketball, Nate Chorney with the step through and the pretty pass to his buddy Terrell Garner for the finish. That's how to fake out the D and the cameraman a little bit there. Chorney, Garner, and Edison will all be in action this week at the Josh Palmer Tournament. At number four, Jackals hosting the Manchester Monarchs. Monarchs cough it up right in front of their own net and Sebastian Sylvester makes him pay. He fires one top shelf. The Canadian leads Elmira with 15 points on the season so far. Number three, Waverly Tioga boys basketball. Hunter Bodine controlling the tempo heel and then watch this dribble move behind the back before dishing to Gavin Judson for the jump shot. That's just pretty passing and it's pretty well executed too. Waverly boys are off to a good start this season. They'll be look to, looking to improve on plays like that. Your number two play of the week, more IAC action. Notre Dame versus Newark Valley here. Ben Cook with the big block, and that's just mean. But take another look. In fact, it was a double block. Gary Roppers needs some credit there, too. Both guys got a hand on it. Notre Dame went on to win that one, 57-42. to 42. And sitting at number one this week, your WEMY top play of the week, Elmira Girls Basketball, Kiara Fisher crosses over then throws the casual no-look pass to Zaria Thomas for the three-pointer. Take one more look at that. I'm telling you, watch out for this team at the Josh Palmer Tournament this week. They are a sight to behold. Congrats, Elmira. You will have our WEMY Top Play of the Week.